Hi, Sandra Duran Wilson here. Come master the mediums with me, acrylic mediums that is. Have you ever wondered what all those different supplies are for when you look at them in the art supply store? Well, then this is the class for you. Every time I teach this, I include different gels, paste, or mediums. So if you've taken it before, take it again because we've got some new things we're going to be working with. I'm showing you how to work with uh, viscosity in your paint, whether it's to get a watercolor effect or to work on this uh, ampersand encaustic board, which is a fabulous panel. You can get beautiful effects by painting through fabric and using the viscosity of the paint to create this very interesting background. You'll let the paint dry, and when it's dry, you'll pull the fabric off and you'll see this interesting pattern that you get. Great way to jumpstart your painting. We're also going to be working with paste and through a stencil. This is a really good way to add some lights back into a dark area of a painting, but you'll also learn what holds the paint and what resists the paint. So as I build up colors, I work with those qualities of the gels and paste, and I can put it on and then remove it and build my colors and my surfaces this way so you never get mud with your paint colors. It's a wonderful way to work and you control it. You save a lot of money by using the gels and paste instead of just paint. Then we're going to switch gears and we're going to work with heavy body paints to look at how you can dry brush to really accentuate your textures. We're also going to play around with some fun ways to move your paint. This is a great way to either jumpstart a painting or to work over an older one. And it's just a lot of fun. So we're working with fluid paint, some water, and deli sheets. And we're using the water and the paper to move the paint around. Not only do you get a background, but you get a great collage paper also. Then we're going to switch over. We're going to learn how to get that resin shiny look. I'm going to top it off with a clear finish. So come join me and learn all about these different acrylic mediums. Every time it's different. I'll see you in the class.